China turns into the South China Sea when rivers and reservoirs overflow. Heavy rainfall hit the province of Henan, causing flooding in numerous towns and cities. The flood control headquarters said some 300,000 people in 50 townships in Zhang Jiajie City have been evacuated because of the flooding threat. Some breaches along the river have already resulted in 1,500 hectares of farmland inundated and 84 houses collapsed. Zhengzhou, the provincial capital of 12 million people, was one of the hardest hit areas, with entire neighborhoods submerged. The death toll from floods that ravaged central China now stands at 302. The headquarters have ordered round-the-clock patrols along the river embankments and dams, as water in five of the city's ten reservoirs reached their brim. Heavy rains that lasted for more than two weeks have triggered severe floods in central China's Hubei and Hunan provinces, bringing damage to those regions these days. A total of 50 people are still missing across Henan, the vast majority of them from Zhengzhou. Of the total deaths, 292 were from Zhengzhou, Wu said. Most were killed from floods and landslides, while several dozen were killed from house collapses, and another 39 drowned in underground spaces, including basements and garages. The headquarters warned that its hydrological stations in Zhang Jiajie monitored that the river is suffering from the worst flooding in 65 years. Due to the continuous rains, a section of highway in Zhang Jiajie city, Hunan province, saw a landslide on Tuesday morning, cutting off the roads. The flooding hit smaller cities and villages as well, with rivers swelling beyond warning levels and numerous reservoirs overflowing, affecting hundreds of thousands of people. The Lishui River, which runs through Zhang Jiajie, China's famed tourist spot in central Hunan province, is suffering from severe flooding, the provincial flood control headquarters said Tuesday. After the accident occurred, local emergency management and transportation department personnel soon arrived on site to clear the soil and rocks that blocked the roads. The severity of the flooding was captured by numerous videos shared on Chinese social media, which showed people and cars swept away in surging torrents.